Hi, Yale from Tech Valor here. Coming at you with another quick video to talk about location-based reminders. Uh, location-based reminders are wonderful. For example, uh, you need to remind yourself the next time you go into town, you need to pick something up. And if you don't have a set schedule to go into town, like those of us who live out in the boondocks usually don't, these are, these are wonderful to use. Uh, the best way to let you see how they work is just to go ahead and create one. I will be creating these manually instead of using Bixby Voice, which is obviously a lot quicker. But the way that I'm filming this video, uh, the two don't work and play well together. So let's begin. I have my reminders in my edge panel, as you can see. And all I have to do is click on Reminder. And at the bottom of the screen down here, click the plus sign to add a new one. So the first one I'm going to make is to remind myself to pick something up the next time I go to Mountain Home, which is a town close to me. So here we go. So that's going to be my reminder. And we need to go ahead and set the conditions here. And as you can see, this is going to be, uh, this is where you have a choice. You can sit or set a specific date and time or a location. So we'll go ahead and click on location. Now the thing to notice here is that you have keyword and address. And here's the difference. Keyword is the one you use when you're searching for a specific place. Address is when you want a specific area, a town, or you have an actual street address. So for me, since I'm going to base this on the next time I go in the general vicinity of a town, I'm going to use address. But just to show you what happens if you don't, I'm going to go ahead and search for Mountain Home, Arkansas right here and show you what happens when it's showing keyword. Now notice when I searched for Mountain Home, it gave me a bunch of addresses of different businesses in my town. Well, that's not what I want. So I'm gonna hit cancel there, set conditions again, specific time and location. And I'm gonna hit address this time. Now, when I hit Mountain Home, Arkansas, it will take me to the town. See the difference? That's important. So. Now that you've got the general vicinity laid out, down at the bottom of the screen down here, you can either select when I arrive or when I leave. So I'm going to go ahead and click on when I arrive. It's highlighted in blue and I'm going to hit done. So now the next time that, you know, my GPS, which by the way, you do have to have that enabled for this to work. Next time I go into Mountain Home, I'm going to get the reminder to pick up the moonshine. So now I'm going to hit save and done. So that is, you know, how you, um, you know, how you set up a location based reminder. You can additionally do that when you're leaving a certain location. For those of us, again, in the country, our mailboxes are kind of far away from our houses. So I can uh, remind myself next time I leave the house, that I can check the mailbox. Therefore, we'll set another one up. So I'm going to check the mailbox. I'm going to set my conditions with a specific location. And this time, I'm going to go ahead and search again. And here I've already got home set up, so I'll just select that. And then this time in the bottom, I'm going to put when I leave and done. So now, as soon as GPS shows that I have left where I'm at, it's going to remind me to check the mailbox. Uh, there's all kinds of things you can do with this, but I find this is really handy, especially when, you know, like I said, you live outside of a town and you don't go to town every day. Anyway, I hope that's helpful to you, and uh, stay curious, techies.